Good evening. Victims abused by former Bishop of Lewis, Peter Ball, have said they're angry and frustrated that he's been released from prison after serving only half of his sentence. He was jailed in 2015 after pleading guilty to a string of historical sex offences. Chrissy Reedy reports. The former Bishop of Lewis, who's now 84, was released just 16 months into a 32-month sentence. A decision that's angered one man who says he was targeted by Peter Ball. These victims and survivors have had to wait more than 20 years since these cases were first reported for this case to come to trial and come to justice. The fact that there's such a short sentence in this case and the amount of time served is less than a month for each of the victims I think is a very poor reflection on the criminal justice system in this country. Peter Ball was jailed in October 2015 after pleading guilty to a string of sexual offences against young men during the 1970s and 80s. An internal review into the abuse was commissioned by the Church of England and due to be published in May, as well as an independent inquiry next year after it's alleged the church had received several complaints from victims in 1992 but didn't inform the police. The prosecution and conviction of Ball was delayed by 23 years because of that cover-up by the Church of England. So we need to make sure that the individuals within the Church of England who were responsible for that cover-up are held accountable. A Ministry of Justice spokesman said sex offenders are robustly risk assessed and subject to a strict set of conditions. The Church of England told us that Ball has been prohibited from ministry for life. Chrissy Reedy, BBC South East Today, Eastbourne.